He wow, was wearing a vest under that? Wow. Oh wait, it's not a vest, it's like... It appears to be Borat's mankini. Yeah, it's like a coveralls with no <laughs> butt. Oh, fucking laser! But he's fine. You know who shoots lasers. Oh, Fuck. Yeah. What? It's a really cute robot! Oh my god! Sorry, Goku could do a lot, but he can't be a robot midget riding a motorcycle stripper. But who is this fucking character all of a sudden? His henchman? It's probably the brain of Champ transported into <laughs> a robot midget's body. That makes more sense than I care to think about. This is his chance to get revenge. Hack the robot, you idiot! Oh no, my no, god, no. the robot is gold. The robot is made out of gold. Is he gonna do loads of light? Oh, it's a tiny man. <laughs> oh, it's Dr. Jen. He's gonna kill him with his head! Vice versa, flip that around. Fucking beautiful. I think that should be the new firearm in the future. I'm just gonna throw that out there. I think that guy got fucking owned. Like, who needs guns when you can just carry around stripper heads? He had better carry that around and use it for the rest of the movie. It's gonna be, serve you way better than that pole ever would. <laughs> just put the head on the pole. Stick it around. Oh my god! Board. Yes! Then you could, like, shoot the pole into the stratosphere and use your orbital laser beam from her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Is that water or cement or both? Uh, I'm gonna go with. Or maybe actually, it's just from the look on his face, I don't want to say it. <laughs> when this dude is decadent to the extreme. I that could. Ah, that's why. Too bad. Too bad. Uh. <laughs> I don't know how getting a little wet is considered suffering, actually. He's gonna open up the lava tube. Oh, Goku oh, looks mildly like, put out. And encase him in stone. He looks mildly disappointed about this. Mm -hmm. Luckily, I think he can open the doors with his eye. Probably. You're an idiot, villain. Doesn't he know that robot eyes let you breathe under water? It'll cut to Goku just getting mouth to mouth from the robot head. Yeah. Ah. It's the only way that makes sense. Goku's not doing too well. Well, then maybe the robot stripper will save him. Now or all the women are that. dead. Crows. Crows. Oh, now it says clothes. Why couldn't they make up their fucking minds? It was probably worked out by two different teams. <laughs> Well, this scene is just girls sliding down, so yeah, that's a second string animation. Exactly. But see, the second stringers, they're bored enough that they can actually study English between the animation and the doors closing. Well, they get all the animation done in, what, 10 minutes? Exactly. It's, hey, I'm at the cell of a door. Okay, I'll film it while we slide it down. Whenever his eye does something, it makes a noise like it's screaming chihuahua or something. Yeah, that's how you know it's uh, working. Now, I personally would have opened that before I closed all the other doors, but that's because I like oxygen. <laughs> that is way I, more water than was in that room. I don't follow what the fuck is going on here. He's riding the wave, like, through the hallway. He's just gonna drown these dumb fuckers. They're just standing there I, staring at this fucking... their own death. There is no way there was that much water in that How room! How is there this much water?! Maybe his, uh... Maybe his robot eye is also really thirst quenching. I think I was right. I think it was the battle of the yeah, Quite possibly, yes. Because I'm sure the robot stripped the motorcycle just... <laughs> shoots that out in space. It's like a fucking sprinkler system. War is just like a woman. You have to spend a lot of money on her. Take notes, everyone! Oh uh, shit! <laughs> Wait, how was the water busting open that door and not the ones that were trapping him inside? I don't know! There's just a lot of it. 
<laughs> this makes more sense than I care to think about. Oh, that just looks painful. Is the entire city just gonna end up flooded? I think so. There's nothing gonna stop this water. <laughs> <laughs> Punch. Yes, he does have the seven heads still. Thank God. We at least know that he's going to get what's coming to him from the one thing he thought would never betray him. His robot motorcycle stripper. Put the head on the ball, please. You can do yes. this. She has fangs. Mm -hmm. That's why she's the best woman. <laughs> Holy shit, how far did he fly? That had some fucking power behind it. I don't and yeah, as you can see, the entire like city is flooding. Yeah, clearly. Too much fucking water. This building, this this story building is 49 floors of fucking water. I think that he made his whole mega corporation thing on just taking the entire Earth's water supply. <laughs> See, how is that water flowing through the room and out the building without, like, sweeping the glass in her head out of it? I don't know! It's magical! I suppose it well, doesn't really matter in the end, because he just came to do one with the robot motorcycle stripper's head, but... Oh, these are the answers away. that science demands. Yes. God, there's another one of these! There are two of these! How can there possibly be, like, good ideas that they didn't put in this one? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, this is no Kanye or Hurricane, but I still can't hate it. Oh, there it goes. That's either a man or a woman who really needs to stop smoking. <laughs> I think it's just the 80s. <laughs> well, that was fucking fantastic. That was incredible. Probably. So we hope you've enjoyed Goku Midnight Eye nearly as much as we have. Because we fucking loved it. Jesus Christ. Oh, it was, was so lacking a pointless sex Well, we'll probably get more of those in the second round. I'm fucking sitting here walking out to this. Getting down to this. So for anyone who has never seen a Yoshiaki Kawajiri film before, this is uh, fairly typical of how amazing he is. <laughs> it's par for the course, isn't it? Like, I've, I've, I've heard a fair amount before watching this, but I've never actually seen Goku Midnight Eye until right now. Yeah, and, it's uh, to me. Does not disappoint. <laughs> it pretty much does the opposite. Yeah. It exceeds. I mean, I think hey, I am Kaz set for life, this. quite frankly. Hey, Kaz worked on this. It's good to know. Fighting in the danger. There you go. That she's actually saying fighting in the danger. Exactly. Well, that because that's if if a title one. is in English, that has to be the chorus of the song, also. <laughs> so, which one of them was Pigsy? Uh, that one. <laughs> Maybe that one. Or all of those. I don't know, it's fucking all- Look, Dr. Zen, that's what that says. <laughs> oh my god, that fucking robot ninja cyborg <laughs> guy. I was actually a little disappointed when it was Dr. Zen and not Champ. It's the first time I've ever wanted to be a midget. And, guess we can't argue with that. Alright, this has been, uh, let's watch Goku Midnight Eye with Niku and Frocto. Thank you very much for watching. Holy shit, that rules. Jesus Christ, that was amazing. <laughs> Bye! Bye!